So right now what the foundation is doing is pretty much promoting what this Golden Triangle Asian Elephant Foundation model is. So basically it's a new system where we rent an elephant from the mahouts or from the owner to come and work with us at the foundation and sort of like provide them with a new sustainable sort of income so that they are able to not bring their elephants begging in the street or doing jobs that are a bit too demanding of them. The, the lack of elephants in the wild, uh, particularly in this region, and, and how their range has shrunk has been to human use of forests. Um, there's been a little bit of poaching along the way, but mainly we cut down all the trees and took away all the places where they could live and then when they started coming out of the places they used to live into human habitat we then persecuted them and made life very uncomfortable for them and as time went on they either moved away or were hunted down or were caught and brought into captivity which is still happening in certain countries not in Thailand. I think what attracts people to elephants is their intelligence, the fact that they do live in family groups um, that they th there are connections obviously with us uh, and there are parallels in the way that, that we live our lives from there are, there are elephants who are, have, a, have a personality of, of calm nurturing there are elephants who have a personality of crazy fun loving pranksters there are elephants that have a personality of, of being not so nice being grumpy being a bit bits of loners and everything like that so I think that resonates with people of course our elf the Asian elephant are also an endangered species so there's not a lot left in a while but a lot of them are still here in captivity but the number if you compare the number to maybe two or three hundred years ago those numbers the number of elephants we have now are just only a fraction of what we used to have. That's due to urbanization and anything we do in the last hundred years. Yep, yeah, Mr. and Mrs. Tetarev were, um, they stayed at the Four Seasons Tented Camp. Uh, they were, they were there for I don't know how many nights even, but they were there for a few nights. They got to uh, got to meet the elephants, to interact with the elephants, and fell in love. They very, very kindly and very easily helped us with three elephants, um, helped us address a massive problem at that time. Now, unfortunately, those elephants have now gone on to other things, but that's that's part of growing up. People don't stay with you, and now they they very, very kindly. Have, have seen the way that the foundation has developed and help us with the vet care, help us with a single elephant here as well, and really help us move in the direction that we, we want to move, which is not just to, to look after the elephants on site, but to do something bigger in the local community and, and leave, a, uh, leave a lasting contribution. So they, they continue to be heavily involved and uh, I'm very, very thankful to them.